Hello everybody out here on YouTube and as I here with Beautiful Beauty. Going to be doing a Lush Bar uh, shampoo review today. Okay guys, you know the drill here. I um, use a lot of the Lush shampoo bars. Now I will say this, I, I always say this in my Lush shampoo bar reviews. I really wish um, Lush brand would start making a shampoo bar that is um, free of sodium lauryl sulfate that um yeah that doesn't do that so uh it doesn't have that ingredient but anyhow i've been asking the company for about three years now if they planned on making in the future possibly a uh, bar that does not have sodium lauryl sulfate and so far the answer is no okay anyhow moving on to the review here um this is this one's called the squeaky green green bag okay this is more geared towards um scalps and oily hair and what I like to use this for is to help remove buildup. This works well for me to remove the residual buildup. I have had a summer long fun time of swimming. I've had some chlorine damage done to my hair. I have a lot of product buildup as well. Uh, not only has the chlorine probably bonded with my hair and formed that somewhat chemical bond that probably should have never happened but it did. And I've used a ton of products all summer long and a deep conditioning mask, hair oils. I've done a lot of hair oiling. I've done a lot, a lot of conditioners, a lot of products, a lot of shampoos, um, a lot, a lot, a lot. This really helps with uh, removing that residual buildup. And it, it really clear, it cleans and clears off my scalp, so to speak, and removes that buildup that has been way waiting and weighing my hair down towards the um, upper roots. I like to have some fullness and some lift and a little bit of oomph, if you will, to the main of the, you know, to like my lion's mane uh, where my roots are. So I, I love my roots lifted up some and to give me fullness. I like that fullness because when my hair starts getting weight, weighted down up towards the roots and it just, it, it looks real flat on top and then the rest of my hair is all frizzy because I do have an uneven hair texture. Parts of my hair are frizzy, parts of my hair are straight and it's really crazy. I, I really wish that my hair was either straight all over or frizzy all over and I would not mind it to be uh, frizzy and, and full of fullness all over. That would be great too. But um my hair texture, you guys, that's just how it is. It's uneven. I have frizziness along with pieces of straight hair. And um, I guess it's always been that way. As far back as I can remember when I was a kid, I always remember that too, that I had a few straight parts of my hair and a few, you know, uh, frizzy parts. But anyhow, this really helps remove that residual buildup from the roots of my hair. And uh, yeah, it helps me get back that, that oomph and that, that lift, you know what I mean? Smells really good. I do feel it is a little overpowering in the smell department. But of course, I mean, you guys know that's what Lush is famous for. They're famous for aroma, um, their aromatic fragrances, uh, their fruity fragrances, their cit citrus fragrances, uh, their, um, yeah, all kinds of fragrances you get out of Lush. You know what I mean? Uh, anyhow, let's see what else I can tell you about it here. Okay. Okay, so anyhow, let's just kind of look along here together. Um, yeah, the smell is very strong. It is a little bit overpowering with the smell. And the reason I say this, you know, I know that Lush is strong smelling and I expect that. I do have a scent sensitivity issue and I have really bad sinus problems. Yet I still love using, you know, fragrance fragranced products. It is a little bit strong. Now, I don't feel that it lasts uh, in your hair that long as far as the smell. It, it really fades out, so it does not last too long. So that is a little bit of a, a plus or a bonus. I know that the Jason and the Argan Oil Shampoo Bar, that lasts a long time smell-wise in your hair. Second, third, fourth day hair, you can still definitely strongly smell that. Uh, so it's not as, um, you know, overpowering as Jason and the Argan Oil is, uh, but it does last. On the second day hair, it seems to diminish and you will not smell your hair as, as much. You know what I mean? So it does diminish. Anyhow, 
it's the squeaky green green bag it says effective shampoo bar um, for echo warriors i don't know guys what's an echo warrior <laughs> are we echo warriors okay you know what i mean um but anyhow it says squeaky green is our herbal shampoo for oily locks and stressed out scalps now it is very herbally smelling i was going to say that earlier it's almost a little bit of a, a medicinal herbally medicine type of smell to it so um that's what it smells like basically okay and it says it has uh, stimulating rosemary it has peppermint and tea tree oil to cleanse the scalp and hair it has soothing vanilla and chamomile to calm any irritation or itchiness of the scalp. And let's see, what else does it say? It is vegan. The featured key ingredient is the rosemary. Okay, and there's the ingredients over here. Unfortunately, sodium lauryl sulfate is always the top number one ingredient of their shampoo bars. I wish, I wish, I wish that was different. And I love shampoo bars, you guys. I've been using shampoo bars for at least five years now. I love handmade, um, hand, just hand done, handmade hand created shampoo bars i buy a lot of shampoo bars from etsy i buy a lot from ebay great great shampoo bars great soap and shampoo bar makers out there i also like the uh, chagrin valley i like the apple valley brand and the tj liggett bars all those are great there are um so many shampoo bars that i use and the only ones I use that have sodium lauryl sulfate, unfortunately, are lush. Okay, so, but anyhow, just um, just bringing truth, honesty, and everything out here, you know, to the table. You know what I mean? So there's the ingredients. You know, and that's basically it. And I do, you know, I really like the fact that, you know, Lush is cruelty-free. They do not test on animals. That's always a bonus with me. Always, always, always. I think this is a good shampoo bar. I'm not sure I'm going to be repurchasing it. I feel the scent, the scent, the fragrance, the smell. A little too overpowering for me. A little much, so probably not. But it's been very good for help removing the residual buildup and residue off the roots of my hair. I do like that. It's been good for my scalp love the fact of that and also it has been lasting a long time it has not crumpled like the jason the argan oil shampoo bar does and if you guys have checked out my videos on that i have purchased that three times over every single time it has crumpled like a stale cookie and um yeah it's been a little bit of a a little bit of a headache with that shampoo bar so to speak because it's it's just crumpled so easily but this one has been lasting a while it is still intact and I do like it and uh, love you guys so very much. Take care. Bye, beauties.